All right, this is a little review on the Super ATV Polaris General seat lowering kit. I already got it on there. If you guys want to watch how to actually get it on, it's not that hard. SuperATV.com's got a YouTube uh, video that shows fairly well how it goes on. So really all you do, just in a nutshell, there's f these four bolts. Take those out of the plastic piece. This is the whole plastic piece that comes off. Put the metal piece on. The spring is kind of a pain in the butt, but just put it all together, follow the instructions. There are two different brackets for that piece. One is for the passenger seat, one's for the driver's seat. So just make sure you put in the right one. But uh, I've already had this, had the driver's seat in and out. I didn't do the passenger seat. But uh, I'm going to give you a little overview and, and show you how fun it is. And I'll let you decide whether or not you're going to try to get another inch and a half out of your headroom. So stay tuned. All right. So let's see if this thing clicks right back in. Well, first thing you want to do is you want to get your battery tender wire out of there because that space no longer exists. It doesn't click in. latched not as easy as stock for sure but I don't have it leaned all the way I don't have it pushed all the way back like I normally would when I first put this in I had it pushed all the way back to the to the farthest back setting where I would normally have it and I couldn't get it in at all that sounded bad I couldn't get the seat latched so what I ended up doing, and this is just to help everybody, because, I mean, I was, I mean, there is a difference, noticeable difference in the seat height. It is only like an inch and a half, but it, it is noticeable. Is it worth 130 bucks? That's up to you. But, so what you got to do is when you get everything put together correctly, you got to slide the seat all the way forward. You have to, like, slide it all the way forward, otherwise it, will, it won't latch at all now this is the next fun part it, it won't come unlatched either so what you do then is you got to slide the seat back to get it unlatched it's not fun let's see if i can get it back Yeah, how's this for a review? Okay, I got it finally latched back in. It was about five minutes and two of my knuckles were bleeding, but I mean, kind of, I mean, there is a difference. It is lower, 
but I think all it's really doing is it's kind of sitting it a little bit more forward because you cannot put it in the back position. It's going to be pushed all the way forward. Same on a play. It's finally, it is latched in, but Jesus, that's a pain in the ass.